Alright guys, this is Chris G. I'm back with my gaming channel, T Gameology. And I'm here doing a Red Dead Redemption 2. And guys as always I wanna say thank you for uh subscribing to my channel, watching my videos, liking my videos commenting good or bad don't care i appreciate it all guys i really do and having said that let's do this oh guys this will be walked through hmm. i want to say 109 but i'm not a hundred percent sure 109 no this will be 119 guys all right, so this is we walk through 119, and we're doing legendary animal. I think it's the pronghorn. Yeah. So, guys, that was at Fort Mercer. Wiped them out. There's some money on the table in there you can get. I'd say about $250, $300, something about like that. And there's also some Red Siege around here, guys, and some... English Sage, I think it is, right here. Or maybe it was a little over here. Either or. In, from the R to the O, just ride there, guys. You'll get some English Mace if you're looking for it. And like I said, over here it was Red Siege. That's what it is. English Mace, not English Siege. And Red Siege is over here, guys. And like I said, if you take out Fort Mercer... There's about $250 on inside just sitting on the table. Alright guys, so... Like I said, I was... Uh, I cleared out Fort Mercer and I was looking for a couple plants I haven't got. Because I know the last six plants I haven't got are all in... Somewhere in New Austin. I have gotten four of them now, guys. There's only two left. Um... There's one in Tumbleweed, but I can't remember where. I think the Black Current was in Tumbleweed. Anyways, guys, let's get back to what we are doing. And that will be hunting this son of a gun. So again, guys, this will be walked through 119. I know, guys, it is crazy. We are at 119 videos. You reckon, eh? Ways off. We get three clues. And I'll be right in front of our face, guys. Honestly, the easiest hunting is legendary animals. Because that usually there's only three clues. Usually there's only three clues, guys. And after the third clue, he'll just basically pop up in front of your face. So this is our third clue, guys. Let's get ready for this. Tracks real fresh. Oh, he's right there, guys. See him? What's behind that? There he is. Time to die, buddy. See you guys right in front of our face. Easiest animals to kill in this whole game, but of course when you're going for coats 
can never find a three star animal. The one thing I love about the legendary animals, guys, it doesn't even matter what gun you use, it doesn't matter how hard or how many times you shoot them, you never ruin their pelts. It's just pretty cool feature. I wish the other animals were like that for Jesus sakes. So guys, I'm gonna end this video here because I'm just gonna drop this off at the trapper. And I think there is another legendary animal somewhere down here in my route on this crazy uh, games and missions in this game. Okay, there's still about six animals I need to find, guys. Um... So we need to find a Rio, a wild turkey. Still need to find Rufus, which I believe you only get after a certain amount of missions in Epilogue 2. That ain't good, guys. One thing I tell you about this desert is full of mountains that you can't get down. You really did that? Like really, you did that. And now my goddamn legendary fur is gone. What the hell, guys? That shit better end up at the trapper like they say it does. I'm gonna be pissed, guys. Did my horse die? Jesus, that was ridiculous. I was just trying to look out the, off the cliff for freak's sakes. You abandon your legendary animal, visit the nearest fence, and the trapper access quality parts and pet pelting for crafting. Does that mean it's at the freaking thing on my bottom? And my horse didn't die, guys. That's pretty cool. I guess we can just sleep now and go to the trapper. But alright, guys, I'm going to end this video here, and I will be back shortly with another one. And I will probably get another legendary animal to... to attach to this video because it is a pretty short video guys so again i will always say one love thanks for the support and i'll see you guys soon so peace out all right guys so it's christy and we're back catching trying to catch a legendary fish I'm not sure which one it is. I don't think this is legendary, guys.
Yeah, I'll show you on the map. It's right here, so. I don't know, maybe it was legendary fish. Legendary Redfin Pickerel. All right, guys. All right, guys. So you know the deal now. Got to go to the. I go to the mail. Mail that fish. Very kids with no bird in it. Already done. Alright guys, so again this has been a pretty short video, so I will attach it to the other legendary pronghorn video so that would be a legendary pronghorn and um red fin pickerel legendary red fin pickerel all right guys so again one love and peace out all right guys this is christy i'm back with my game and channel t that gameology and i'm here doing okay then john just trying to do an intro, but anyways, guys, we're doing Red Dead Redemption 2. This will be walk through 120, I believe. And oh, look at that, guys! There's a question mark on the ground. Wow! So, guys, we've been coming here twice. I believe I've come here twice now. And <coughs> excuse me, there's Tanaka Bison. When I came before, I couldn't get the question mark, it was really weird. Twice I couldn't get the question mark, I did not understand. And so, it's one of the few things I actually looked up on the internet. And it told me to do a trick, which was, so guys, you could do this if it happens to you, apparently. Obviously, the question mark is there, so I don't actually, um, you know what I think the problem is, guys? The first two times I came here... There was a dude camping right here. And I got a funny feeling 
if there's a camp here then you guys will not get the question mark that's what it seems to be if you ask me but anyways um like I said I read about it online and they said come to this markers right so you guys see the markers right beside the path literally right beside the path right you guys see it there right so look at this marker on your map or this question marker on your map and if it's not there you see the spot where it's supposed to be the gentleman on the line said you come to the area equipped a fire a molotov cocktail apparently you throw it i assume right there and once you do that and the fire subsides, I guess the question mark will then appear. Which is pretty cool. But anyways, guys. As always, thanks for following my channel. For subscribing to my channel. Watching my videos. Liking my videos. I appreciate it all, guys. I really do. And having said that. Let's get this bison attack Tanak and bison hunt on the go. All right, guys, let's do this. But you know what's fucked up? I just realized, guy. I don't have any of my guns, so this is gonna. Jesus, this is gonna be painful. You know what? Fuck that, I'm just gonna dynamite his ass. Guys, you ready? Because he's about to be present. There he is, guys, right by the tree. Sorry, dude. A beautiful coat on him. Jesus, come on, skin the thing already.
thank you and sorry, buddy. Where the hell did the horse go? Guys, there's only one legendary animal after this, and I believe it's the the cougar. I don't know. Maybe we'll get him next. I think there's one legendary fish to get to. And that's a rat. Jeez, how far away did I run from this horse? not even here anymore. Guys, where did the horse go? Wow. Fucking wow. There's a horse there. Finally.
Oh, come on. Are you kidding me? Here we go. What the fuck? Why couldn't I fast travel? Guys, did you just see that horse fall down? What the fuck? Where did this damn horse go? Bro, you got my pal. Don't be around, man. It's a gunshot, homie. Relax.
<laughs> Whoa. Just about any price for this. <laughs> Nothing quite like wearing your best day's work. Wow, guys, I think there's only four left if I uh, counted that correctly. One, two, three. Sorry right, guys, I'm going to end this video here and I will probably attach another 
legendary animal or maybe the legendary fish so right now I'm gonna go get my regular horse but anyways guys I will end this video now sorry about yawning I will end this video now and I'll be back with another video shortly again guys just wanna thank you for your appreciation and one love and peace out Alright guys, so uh, just uh running around here and I notice on the map an X. And as you can see there's some birds up there. So there seems to be a body up there, but um I don't know if I can get to it, I'm trying to. I'm running around in circles so it looks like a possibility. Yes guys. Get up here. All right, guys. So this is how this went down. I was doing a. Uh, was just riding back from. Um, I don't know, doing some challenges and I discovered that X which usually represents a body so we come up here I investigated I did not uh, have my headphones on so this is uh, like a uh, recording over the actual video and uh, I had to research this guy because of this letter when I found this letter I didn't really know what this letter meant when I read first read this letter and I won't read it to you but um, you guys can read it for yourself I uh, did kind of leave it there long enough for you to read and of course you could always pause it to read it but the gist of it is if you don't know the story apparently this is um, the Grand Theft Auto 6 teaser for the up and coming game which is I don't know when it will be coming out because I've yet to uh, hear about it and if you know anything about GTA 5 it's probably been at least 6-7 years that it's been out and their online content is doing pretty good so that's why they really haven't come out with a with a 6 game but apparently these are the two guys that have uh, created that game and obviously this game too a part of being uh, a rockstar collection <coughs> and basically guys when I looked it up online it said they're basically arguing with each other in this note about coming out with rockstar one brother saying let's come out with rockstar 6 the other brother is saying no oh, let's continue with online stuff if we come out with Rockstar 6, the franchise will die, and stuff like that. <coughs> and as you can see, guys, that's where it is on the map. If you guys want to um, find it. But yeah, that's basically the story I got when I looked it up on Google, guys, was that these are the Rockstar Brothers, or not Rockstar Brothers, but they work for Rockstar make the game but anyways guys I'm going to attach this to a other video so I'll see you shortly in another video one love and peace out